Yo, what's up, YouTube? And today I'm gonna show you how you can get Super Spleef. Um, what this plugin does, it automatically creates Spleef games if you have an arena. So it's automated, and you can have as many arenas and Spleef floors as you want. And I'll show you how to set it up. So you're gonna need this and World Edit. We'll go ahead and download World Edit first. All right. Now click download here. And download Super Spleef. Okay, so we can open up World Edit as long as you have some kind of extracting program like WinRAR. So open it up. And all we need really is this World Edit jar. So we're gonna drag that into our plugins folder. And we're gonna drag Spleef in there too. And now we're gonna set up our permissions. So go into whatever permissions plugin you use. Alright. So you can find these permissions, um, it'll be in the description, or you can just click it if you want. But what I'm gonna give my default players is this these two permissions here the player permissions so you can either do spleef dot join dot arena number and the first one we're going to create is arena number one so you can just put a one at the end after the dot or you can um, add a star which will let them be able to join all arenas and by star I mean By star I mean an asterisk like that. This will let them join all of the arenas, all the spleef arenas. Or you can just put the number arena like arena 1, arena 2, arena 3. And I'm going to use that. And now we're going to add our next one, spleef.start. And you can go ahead and add any staff permissions or admin permissions I've got everything now so I'm just gonna save alright so before we actually go onto our server we're gonna stop our what we ran and we're gonna go in well now we're gonna wait for it to stop loading and now we're gonna close out of it did that so now we can go in our plugins folder and find super spleef folder and go into config and we're gonna set up our config file and ignore that because that was the arena that I created but you won't have one yet I'll show you how to create one so here is where you can set up everything auto start players is just how many players you need to automatically start the game within this amount of time that you can change to join messages that's all up to you so nuke detection you should enable this because you won't want any nuke players and this will automatically kick them but yeah set that up how you want save it and then restart your server I'll see you on Minecraft alright so once you're on minecraft come to your spleef arena and I actually created this one myself I took some time out to make it so if you want you can download this it'll be in the description and it's free to download alright so now to create our arena we're gonna need to type slash spleef create arena and then it says arena one created so now we've got our first arena. Now we're going to set up a win point. So it's going to be the point where the player that win goes to. So type slash spleef, set win, and then the arena number. You always have to type the arena number and not the arena name. So it's going to be one for me. Alright, that's the win point. Now we're going to set a lose point. 
that the losers go to. Okay, so type slash spleef set lose and the arena number one. Alright, now we're gonna set a spawn point. I'd make it in the middle if you want. Slash spleef set spawn one. Now this is gonna be the spawn point that all the players spawn at, so you don't need to create any other spawn points. And now we're gonna type slash slash wand to get our wand tool. And um I made this point here, you know, for circular spleef arena is gonna be a little bit more difficult. But you can just line up the corner and make it parallel to the sides so that it, it gets every everything, you know? So but if it's like a square arena, then all you have to do is select the corner. The corner is already there. So left click to select it. Your first position, now fly diagonal from it and select your second corner. Or position. Alright, so like I did here, I, I lined it up parallel to the sides. Alright, now we got our second position set. Now we can type slash spleef add floor. Oh, sorry add floor and the arena number one floor added now for safety measures we're gonna back this floor up like backup file so if we if, if we lose it we don't have to do all this again you can type slash leaf save then one for the arena number alright to load it you just instead of having save there you just type load alright but ours is already loaded so now the last step is to enable it type slash spleef enable and then the arena number there we go now we're going to need a sign we're going to create the join signs that player just players can right click on to join so put it anywhere you want and in brackets put Belief. Make sure you capitalize the first S. Then close the bracket. Then the second line, the first C. Make sure everything that I have capitalized is capitalized for you. So click to join. And then arena. Notice how the first A is capitalized. Space. Then the arena number. So there's a space there. Alright, there you go. Now right click and you're in there. All you have to do is type slash belief leave and you left the arena. So it's that easy. I will have this map and the plugin in the description. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. So thanks for watching and subscribe.